Hey people, how are we doing today? It's Wednesday, and you know what that means? It's time for a super video. Uh, it sounded better in my mind, but what do you expect? Anyway, I'm back. What do you think about that? You like that, huh? Thank you. Now, since a lot of people seem to like my strange but true Strange Laws video, I thought I'd continue that. I'd give it part two. Not two. Two. <clears throat> so, oh, two. Sorry about that. Anyone from Britain, I'm sorry. Anyway, I'm going to do it on my, and I'll get all the information from my brand new Amazon Fire. And, are we ready? I hope so. Let me know what, if you'd like this or not. Okay, let me see, uh, in Georgia, it is against the law to slap a man on the back or front. Wait, does that mean we can slap a woman? No, that doesn't sound good. Don't sound good at all. Okay, a barber is not to advertise prices in the state of Georgia. This does not make sense to me. If it makes sense to you, could you explain why? Because it seems to me, competition is getting wild out there. Oh, it's getting really wild. <clears throat> oh, well. In the state of Louisiana, a bill was introduced years ago in the House of Representatives that, it fixed, that fixed a ceiling on haircuts for bald men of 25 cents. Yeah. A haircut for bald men. Hmm. Well, that makes perfect sense to me. I mean, it takes a quarter of the time. Yes, these are the jokes. And these are real laws. Not something I made up. In Oklahoma, no baseball team can hit the ball over the fence or out of the ballpark. I thought that was the point. I may be wrong, but wasn't that the point? Yeah, what do I know about sports? In Kentucky, it's the law that a person must take a bath once a year. Well, I take a shower once a month, whether I need it or not. And for some reason, people want me to take more than that. Huh. Well... I can really sort of stink about that. In Utah, birds have the right of way on any public highway. Why do they pay toll at toll booths? In Ohio, one must have a license to keep a bear. A bear what? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. In Tennessee, the state I live in, a law exists which prohibits the sale of bologna, sandwich meat, on Sunday. I guess that means we have to buy ham or turkey or something like that. Mm, what are you going to do? In Virginia, the Code of 1030 has a statute which prohibits corrupt practices or bribery of any other any person other than a political candidate okay um, I could mention names but I'm not going to do that because I don't want to start a firestorm of controversy <clears throat> In Providence, Rhode Island, it's against the law to jump off a bridge. I guess you might end up getting wet or something. Okay, that makes no sense. In the state of Kansas, you're not allowed to drive a buffalo through a street. I guess if you're, you have to if you're going off to Buffalo. 
in Florida, it's against the law to put livestock on a school bus. Huh. But fish is okay, because fish go to school. In New Jersey, cabbage can't be sold on Sunday. Um, I can't think of a good one for that one. I don't... I'm stymied. <laughs> okay, I'm going to give you two more. In North Carolina, it's against the law for dogs and cats to fight. That's right, they have to get along. Unless they're in the ring. In Singapore, it's illegal to chew gum. Hmm. Well, I'm going to, one more. One, one more quick one. In Cleveland, Ohio, it is unlawful to leave chewing gum in public places. Well, that takes all the fun out of it. It's called sharing. Well, that's it for now. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. Let me know you liked it. If you didn't like it, let me know what you didn't like about it. Because these are true laws that are on the books, strange as they may be. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, and this is your first time here, come on and subscribe. You never know what you're going to get from me. And I mean, you never know what you're going to get, because I hardly know what I'm going to do. That's scary, isn't it? Anyway, like and comment, and if you like this video well enough, share it with your friends. Share it with your neighbors. Share it with your neighbor's friends. If you hated it, share it with your enemies. It's up to you. And, da 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 if you want to, you can follow me on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram, and on Snapchat. And if you really, really, really want to write me a letter, make sure to include a self-addressed stamped envelope. Send it to Kenny Davenport at P.O. Box 198, Crossville, Tennessee, 38557. Well, that's it for right now. And I will have to say goodbye. I'll have yeah, it's time for me to go. I've got to go. And I'll be, I'll be back. I'll be back. For your eyes only. And until then, goodbye.